Welcome to Magic Gathering Strat. This is the Academy Showcase. It is a team battle organized by Just Sin to promote the Academy League. Uh, for that will be starting soon. There's a big article on Academy and the Duke Academy by Justin about this. And to show off to the, uh, this, we are fighting a team battle here. Uh, we're waiting for Shafa Wafa, who is our team captain. Me and GPH Nick are on the same team. I just managed to sneak in Avery61 on the other team. But the other team also has a shuffling back. And Sneak Attack Kid. The Sneak Attack Kid is a tournament winning grinder with his mono black control deck. Um, so, uh, and we're waiting because we don't really know. Uh, we are still missing two people on our team. We have a reserve as well, but he hasn't shown. So, unless, uh, and Justin is uh, gonna start on time, so unless Shafov makes it here in time, he will be replaced on our team. And I think that will be bad for us, because he's the best player on our team. Me and uh, GPH Snake uh, will try to do our best. I'm playing Trinket. I have made a change to my sideboard. I might regret. Um, it's something I'm testing. I'm running three spell bombs. Uh, to win against the other Grim Harvest decks. And uh, uh, GPH Nick is running Love Train! So there will be love! Lots and lots of love. Uh, there's still nine minutes to go. Uh, this is a team battle, so you will. One person starts from each team. And then. Uh, the person who loses will be replaced, and then when everybody is knocked out, this is how it's played in Soul Calibur and other similar video games. So you need to knock out everybody on the other team, but the first person on one team could knock out everybody on the other team. Hmm, Chris. Hmm. No, I must think that Rafa Rafa shows up. It's still eight minutes to go. So I have lobbied for GPH Nick to go first because I want Love Train to be showcased. Uh, it appears the Splashing Black is going first and the Sneak Attack Kid wants to go last because he don't want to trio and uh, kill everybody. And actually he is not incorrect, he is uh, definitely the best qualified player here on the level of Shafarafa and Shafarafa is still not here. Ha! Huh, we got to change uh, back our decks, I'm putting Deep Analysis back for this. I also got uh, Chris Weaver to join us. Oh, we're having uh, uh, Shafa showed up. Uh, so now he and Chris has to sort this out. Um, but Yibeishnik is playing first. Let's ask him for a minute. And I think it's starting. If somebody can figure out how to start the table. 10 ticket challenge. No, that's not ours. Oh, Sneaky Cat wants to go first now. Chaos rules. Match is ready. Where is it? There it is. If he plays Sneak Attack Kid here and wins, uh, and I Love Train has a pretty good matchup, but it's like a of it. 
I will run off to the bathroom here, but I will not shut off the recording so you can see what happens. Worst commentator gig ever. Okay, let's see if there's some love. Sorry for being away. <laughs> see if there's some secret communication here. Alright, give us the love. Uh, he has four cards. And Wall of Roots is a sneak attack kid, must be thinking, what the hell is this? He's transmuting it to Axpin Guardian. Well, okay, by gang. Yeah, that's that's a problem. And probably one that Love Train doesn't want to happen. But on the other side, he has very little uh, aggression coming through here. Oh, sorry for drinking. I I promise not to drink in the videos. I usually pause now, but now I forgot because I was so excited. Okay, down to one card, which then is... Oh, we had the combo, which is Axbane Guardian. So now the question is, will the walls buy him enough time? Oh, he top decked the Muldrifter. And played it. Nice. I actually suck as a magic commentator if I'm not playing. But I will do my best. I have done a couple of videos where I talk about people playing. But here I am invested. 
I really want Love Train to beat Sneak Attack Kid. That would be so awesome. Well, that ninja is not coming through anytime soon. But he has a nice card advantage engine going there with... Uh, not an engine, but a nice card advantage going with Sign Blood, Okiba Gang, etc. He has really torn down uh, Rager, the rats. I'm not a fan of Ravenous Rats, but Sneak Attack knows Mono Black Control much better than I do. But Sneak Attack has to grind uh, Jack down because he will he doesn't have the big punches, he doesn't have the grey merchants, he doesn't have the corrupts, if I know correctly. But he does have all those grand let's let's check out his list. It's in the public domain, right? Uh MTG stats for sneak attack kit. Recent tournament finishes for... here is his list from the 10th. Four Shittering Rats, four Ragers, three Crypt Rats, three Witches. Witches are pretty dead in this matchup, aren't they? Verdict on Earth, the rest. Yeah, it's, it's very basic. But uh, that's what works. There are the Witches. But what now then? Uh, nothing. In team attack, in uh, in uh, fighting games like Total Caliber, you often are very wounded when you move on, when you have defeated, for, for example, Sneak Attacks defeats JPH Snake here, and then, uh, then he would be wounded, but he won't in this game, so he could very well 3-0 this entire tournament. I expect him to block Okiba Gang and kill him here. But I'm not sure. Which is, of course, a problem. Or maybe they are not as bad as I thought. Consider this uh, a lesson in playing Mono Black Control, because there are few people that are as good. <laughs> But I have very little reason to sing right now. He did kill Okiba Gang. There's the deadly recluse, but he will be... <sighs> oh well, if the song will then be... Um, it must have been love, but it's over now. In case uh, JPH Nick loses, but if he wins, well... I can just make creepy remarks about love, maybe. Love terrain. Feel the love. He's being outvalued here, poor JPH Snake. So, will the Stompy deck stand up to this? I don't know. Or will I be forced to face the master mono black control player? You know how much I talked about how good Trinket is against mono black control. We have the statistics, we studied it, but this time it would be tested very hard, though he doesn't have anything in his sideboard except Wrench Mines. So I expect to beat Sneak Attack Kid if I play well, like Power T would win if he played Trinket against Sneak Attack. But I, the skill difference may just be big enough to actually take me out. And now I think... Uh, JPH Snake is losing. 
unless there is a train, but the train will only be for two. They does have a very good sideboard for this, whereas Sneak Attack Kid is not prepared for this. Creature removal here will be painful. But he could then equip it to the other Wall of Roots. Uh, we have been discussing changing. The, if I should play against Sneak Attack, if he wins here. A Maldrifter would be pretty good and would be stabilizing. But another longbow is not. Poor love train. I just installed this uh, program for recording, so I wonder where the files end up that I produce. But I I'll figure that out. Cryptrats! Whiteboard Cryptrats! The only way to go! But that's pretty bad. That's game! And we move on to the second match. I know JPH, JPH Nick has a good sideboard against this. So let's hope he puts it to good use. But this might just be Sneak Attack Kid destroying us all. It's time for me to rehearse the, the sideboard for Trinket against Mono Black Control. Ah, oh, super secret cyborg plan! Don't pause there! Well, <laughs> my cyborg is fairly strong. Fairly strong! Uh, but JPH Nick also had a good game against him. Where the hell did the match go? There it is. They are still cyborging. Okay, it's been decided I am going next. Got drinking again. Yep. Okay, let's see what they're saying. Team chat in join awesome. I should probably not join that. The match is happening. Go Jack! Go Jack! Uh oh, Sneak Attack Kid is keeping the hand. Yeah, Snake plays a Guildgate. Pretty strong start. I think the... Uh, he took out the Witches and brought in at least the Ranch Mines. Let's see what JPH Snake can do. Play Wall. Okay, Justin hasn't answered yet. The wall is a victim of night. Uh, all right, trinket match is on the table. Sorry about that. Had to do some secret team chatting. All right, so shitting rat has died. What's happening then? Malrifter. 
which is very good against all black decks, of course, against anything. But sneak attack is up on cards here. Can he keep grinding? It's such a basic rats list, really. It's just... But it must be working really well. The three deadweights, very good against uh, Delver, but it looks so basic. But he's getting great results with it, so he's really an authority on mono black control decks. And he seems to be doing quite well here. Another Muldrifter, come on now! Nice! Muldrifter is in the house! Right, there is a Ram's Mind getting everything. Once of us through though, why not? But here comes the removal. So grindy! The mono black control deck. Well, we are one card from winning here. No, we are not. But, uh, one thing that... Uh, uh, that the deck can do is just attack. But for this single Muldrifter to go to do another five attacks without getting interrupted seems unlikely. But here Train of Thought would be fantastic. Train of Thought would be super awesome. He would draw four cards. And those Chittering Rats are blind. And actually Muldrifter is keeping up the attack. Now he would draw five cards of a train of thought. The uh, shitting rats are going to town. Okay, by gang. And this, that's a race. And it's a race. The mono black control deck is winning, but there are a lot of good top decks here. He is a beast. Right, is this a Maldrift I see before me? Yes! That's pretty nice. Now a wall as well. Wall longbow, maybe. Trinket match, that's pretty neat. That's better than a wall longbow. I think you can win this! Go JPH Snake! Love! Feel the love! Yes! Oh, he didn't play it because he has the wines! Wow, Cryptrat would do a lot of damage, but with the longbow, well, I don't know. Looks kind of there. There's Victim of Night, and here is the Vines of Westwood. Double blue. Ah, Muddle Mixture. Nice. I wonder if he's blocking here at all, actually. Would be very aggressive not to block. Yeah, he's playing the control game. Not sure if that's... Right. There's another Okiba gang! Very tight! 
Very tight. Oh, we're all racing here. I think he's blocking the shittering rat. And his clock is faster, but one removal is all it takes. Or another creature. There's so many ways for Sneak Attack Kid to win this now. <sighs> so tight. Maldrifter. I have to call out stuff I want him to draw, but he does attacks, so he must have something. Removal now would be disheartening. And I don't know if I'm playing next or not. Maldrifter! Trinket Mage! Axe Bane. Well, this top deck becomes very important. Oh, that's decent. So the next card becomes very important. Ah, can you feel the excitement? Jesus! Do it, Jack! Just one game. Good game. Yes! Alright, so we move on to the third game. All right, it's happening. Can Love Train take out the grinder? I leave it on and run off again. I'm the worst magic journalist ever. Right, looking good so far. That. Ranch mine. Wow. The whole hand. He must have mulliganed like crazy. Oh no. He mulliganed to four. Well, this looks pretty bad.
Well, I'm ready to do this. Bullying to four was rough. That would have been a great uh, last game. So can he stabilize here? Muldrifter pretty much stabilizes the whole game, actually. Jack, if you come back from this, what did he do? Oh, he crypt ratted and sneak attacked. Oh, and she okay, but ganged. Nice. Okay, so he did train, but uh, lost anyway. I like getting all of my damage. That's a pretty. That's a pretty good point. Well, the Kiba gangs will be troublesome for me. I just have to let nothing get through. Cryptrats are back! God, am I ready for this playing sneak attack kid? Well, I did have a streak of 26 wins against NBC and it took Budakov himself to defeat me, so I think I'm ready. I just have to focus, don't do stupid mistakes, etc. The stuff I'm bound to do when I'm playing pauper. But, if I can avoid it, that could work. <laughs> it will be funny if, if Sneak Attack Kid wins with 3-0. So we want Pauper. Thirty minutes. <laughs> 